And welcome in, everybody. Glad you're with us. Interleague Baseball on MLB The Show. It's the Arizona Diamondbacks taking on the Cleveland Guardians. Joined by my partner, Chris Singleton, I'm now, John Shomby. So the Arizona Diamondbacks have taken the first two games of this series, and today yeah. they'll go for the sweep. They played well, Chris, and they're looking for more of the same in this one. Yeah, they've been the side shaking hands on the field after each game so far. Played solid baseball to earn those wins, as you said. But every game offers up its own unique challenges. So we'll see what those are today. But there's always a little extra motivation when you have an opportunity to sweep a series. All right, we'll be back to get this one started after this. Second inning, set to go. Now the third baseman, Gerald Raymond. Great speed and great power. A great athlete, quite simply. Quantrill, back to work. That misses, and it's 1-0. When you have a real athletic player and who's able to do the baseball mechanical things really well, look out, because the sky's the limit on that potential. When you get ahead in the count, there's no doubt that the success rate goes up, and that's what he's been doing. It's made a big impact for him in recent games. Next pitch misses, and that's ball three. And a foul ball. Look out. That ball was smoked. Man, I am so relieved that they have this netting down the lines just ensure safety for the fans last thing is a player you want to look up and see a fan get hit three one and he couldn't come up with it leading off from the diamond back the designated hit and now it's Christian Walker Christian Walker runner, runner. runner on the goal pitch in for a strike throw to second not in time he's there easily you know what I like the aggressiveness right there it looks like it's going to be tough to score in this one really good pitching so far so why not try to put some pressure on him and see if you can steal the bag get in the scoring position Quattro back to work runner goes again not in time he's safe batting six the left fielder. Next Nico up for the Diamondbacks, Holzizer. Nico Holsizer. Here's a guy who's been struggling so far this year. It's only late April, but still hoping he'll turn it around soon. Toss to Naylor. Run scores, but a terrific play to get the out. They'll expect a back and forth this entire game because of how good the offenses are. Wilson Contreras digs in for the Guardians. This guy has turned into one of the best catchers in the game, but was originally signed by the Cubs as an infielder. So RBI spot, but Chris, this is a guy that is not really swinging the bat all that well here. In this situation, you have a real good opportunity to get swings and misses and record a strikeout. I think you attack him in this spot. Toss to Muncie, and Contreras is retired. Deceptive slider right there, stayed in the tunnel a Batting long time, got that hitter out front, rolled over it, put it on the ground. Back here in Cleveland, stepping in the long ball threat, Gerald Raymond. Pretty amazing athlete this guy is. Power and speed, quite a threat. I mean, you're talking about someone that could steal you a bag and go deep. Bo Jackson, anyone? And first offering is fouled off. He's like Mike Trout. You figure whatever you put in his hand, whether it's a bat, whether it's a golf club, whether it's a basketball, he can do it and get it done. And a rare talent, so much fun to watch. Naylor takes it himself and one gone in the fourth as they get the leadoff man. Good two-seam action right there, running away from the batter. And up to hit is Wilson Contreras. Now batting. The catcher, Wilson. John 2-2 two -two down. Bounce to the left side. Raymond handles the chance, whips it across, and Contreras is retired. Now batting, the second baseman, Andre. He met us. Two outs, nobody on. Stepping in, Gerald Raymond. Now batting. He's 0 Third for baseman. 1. He's hitting for Gerald. that pop. Came out of the gates really strong. Quattro back to work. 
And fouled off. Get your pitch and drive it. Let's go, big dog. Nice hit, Line yeah, drive, baby. and that should be extra bases. Now he turns and heads for second. Not stopping. He's going for three. Throw not in time. Safe at third. Now that extends his hitting so streak to an even dozen, Singy. Do opposing pitchers start to take notice when a guy is on a roll like this? Yeah, I think so, Boog. It's not like it changes the scouting report on a guy or anything like that too much, but you're aware of who's swinging the hottest bat, and that's definitely him right now. Runner at third, two gone. And now it's Christian Walker. Quattro back to work. Oh, this is deep to left center. Way back there. On its way. Gone. Home run number five on the season. And they throw a pair on the board. It's 4-4. Four, four. Knew what pitch he wanted to hit, spit on some other pitches in this at bat, was very patient, and it paid off. Here's Miguel Andujar. Now well, it's hard to sweep. No it's even field. harder to sweep a Miguel. team on the road. Andujar. Hey, let's hold him right here. Cleveland up a run, looking for more. This to third. Toss to Muncy, and that is the inning. We look ahead to inning number eight. It's the Guardians five and the Diamondbacks four. First and second, one out. Here's the third baseman, Gerald Raymond. It's interesting he plays kind of a, a power spot defensively, but runs pretty well. So when you're looking at that position, you're not expecting someone that has maybe above average speed, but he does. Oh, big in. Like you can, come on. And a pitch. Rip to first, caught. Now batter. Gerald Raymond will hit next. One for three. He is quite an athlete. I mean, you look around the other sports, basketball, football, you feel like he could thrive in one of those sports, too. Pickoff move to first. Rojas dives back in safely. Back over to first, and he's back in that time as well. pitch and there's a ball nasty backdoor slider there's really nothing you can do with that if you swing at it so it's a good take by him liner base hit they stopped the lead runner at second now two on with two outs another multi-hit game for him he's been really hot lately nice line drive to the pull side met it out front but just stayed through it nice enough and ripped it into the outfield Hey, come on now, big dog. Get your pitch. Rojas on second. Yeah, Raymond on, on at first with two down. That's ripped. Base hit. Play it home. He's safe. And they take a two-run lead. A couple of hits in a row for him here. Off the bat, that one registered at 105 miles per hour, man. That is smoking. And these days, you hear it all the time, but the numbers just don't lie. If you can drive a ball like that, more often than not, you're picking up a knock. The Guardians going with a new pitcher, Nick Sandlin. And his job is to collect quick outs and keep his team within striking distance. 
Sandler. And the batter now, Nico Holsizer. And a count one and two. You can do a rip on it, huh? Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Good job of damage control right there. Last chance to even things up. We head to the bottom of inning number 10. It's the Diamondbacks 7 and the Guardians 5. Well, this is a big win on the road and going extras into 10. Uh, so hard to pull those out, but I think this team did a great job of keeping the crowd out of the ball game late. When you can do that, it kind of calms everything down, keeps the adrenaline of the opposing team down a bit, and you can steal a win and get out of here happy. A 7-5 final score in this one.